Hi everyone, welcome back to Transformers Toys for Kids. This week, we're looking at the Earthspark Terran Nightshade. It's actually the last deluxe class character we need in order to build Mandroid. We have all these pieces and parts. We've had them for months now. If we flip it around to the back, each deluxe class character comes with a different part. We finally have Nightshade, so we have the final body part. They do that on purpose, so you need them all in order to put them together. And we can see the robot mode and the alt mode, which is an awesome owl. So let's open it up and check it out. Terran Nightshade is unboxed and ready to go. Nightshade is a very cool character, has the weapons holding in front. We've got the wings in back that can be posed in all sorts of different directions for when Nightshade is flying around and Nightshade's alt mode is an owl. So I'll show you how that transforms in just a second. But first, we need to put Mandroid together because we finally have all the pieces. We have the torso, so we can plug in the head and all the limbs and see what Mandroid looks like. As a reminder, each of these body parts came with a different deluxe class transformer, and now we finally have enough to put Mandroid together. So let's put his arms on first, which are actually kind of tough to put on. Now, let's get his legs put on. And what could Mandroid be missing now? How about his head? So let's put Mandroid's head on, and then get that snapped in. He's looking pretty good now. I like him a lot, except he has all these robot pieces we can put on the back. Unfortunately, we lost the piece that can connect these two cool robot arms, but we can still get these pieces put on. And now he's looking a lot more intimidating. He is the main bad guy in Transformers Earth Spark. So this is so much fun to actually have a bad guy in addition to the Decepticons. Here we have Terran Nightshade next to Mandroid and Grimlock. Mandroid's looking a little smaller as he should. He's a human compared to Transformers, but he does have this giant robot arm he can fight with and he's super smart. And now we have Nightshade next to Megatron and Twitch. The transformation for Nightshade is actually pretty simple, but first we need to store these knife weapons. And the storage is really nice. So we're gonna take these knife weapons, which kind of look like it's wings. So we're going to put these knives here and over here for storage. And then these knives kind of blend in with the wings. Now for the transformation. We wanna take the head and rotate it around like this. So we have this really awesome looking head here. Very different looking owl head. Then we take the shoulders and rotate them in and rotate them in. And then we have to connect, get these owl legs out of the way, here and here so the legs stay together for the owl form. So slide those in. And we're all done for now with this part. We have to get these robot legs out of the way. So what we can do is rotate everything up like this. We can pinch together the feet. And then they want us to rotate all the way down like this. But to make sure things don't come loose, we're going to plug some things in. So peg some things in here and here in each shoulder. So let's get these put in here and here. And then swing it around and we're going to plug this little tab that's sticking out into the back of its leg. So do that on one side and do it for the other side. Almost there. Push that in. Terran Nightshade is transformed into its alt mode. This is a really cool owl alt mode. We take the feet and we bring them down like this and then Nightshade can soar around and then we can take the feet down and then pull these back and down. And then this is how an owl would look when it's sitting on its perch, looking down for its prey or for Decepticons. All in all, Terran Nightshade is a fantastic figure. Not difficult to transform, holds together well. The paint is awesome. It's a really cool looking owl mode and robot mode. And of course, if you collected just about every deluxe class character, you can put together Mandroid and he'll be an awesome villain to have. 
Hey, I hope you enjoyed watching today. As usual, be sure to tune back in every week for more fun Transformers toys videos.